Hello there, we have another problem for you. In this example, we are given this certain fact that there 17.6 liters of fuel is usually used for every 100 kilometers distance traveled by a vehicle, for example, a car. So in this example, we are trying to convert this values or this units into the corresponding miles per gallon unit. So you must be wondering how do we do that? Uh, if you try to look at the given here closely, it says that we are using 17.6 liters of fuel for every 100 kilometers distance travel. So this is an example of a fuel efficiency of your vehicles and we can transform that in this form that in every 100 kilometers, the car uses up 17.6 liters of fuel. So this form now looks familiar in similar to our previous examples and Using your dimensional analysis, we can now convert this unit into our desired unit in miles per gallon. So, of course, we need our equivalent statements. And these are 1 mile is equal to 1.609 kilometers. And 1 gallon, again, this is 1 US gallon, is approximately equal to 3.785 liters. So, we now then transform this equivalent statements into our conversion factors for us to arrive to our final unit in miles per gallon. So... Looking at our units in the given, we have kilometers per liter. So we need to re transform in the kilometers first. So our first conversion factor should contain the unit kilometer, and that is this equivalent statement. We now write it down here. There. So we have 1 mile is equal to 1.609 kilometers. As you can see, the unit kilometer is in the numerator in our given. So it should be in the denominator in our conversion factor for it to cancel out as shown there. Alright, so we are now left with only the units mile per liter, but looking back, we are desiring to look for the unit miles per gallon. So we need to convert liters into gallons. Okay, so we now have written our equivalent statement in the conversion factor form, showing the units in the proper place so that we can cancel them out. Since the unit liter is in the denominator and are given, it should be in the numerator in our conversion factor for it to cancel out okay so we now cancel the unit liters all right so there you have it we are only now left for the unit miles per gallon which is our desired unit all we need to do now is do the calculation and after doing the calculation it gives us that the answer is 13.36 miles per gallon so meaning in 100 kilometers being traveled by the car for example that uses up 17.6 liters of fuel that is equivalent to the fuel efficiency of 13.36 miles per gallon but wait that is not yet our final answer because we have to always report with the correct number of significant figures we go back to our given now this is a little our there is a little problem here is because the 100 is a little ambiguous okay so we now need to transform this we can think of it that 100 kilometers is written in this form, 1.00 times 10 to the power positive 2 kilometers, which tells us that it has three significant figures rather than this ambiguous form. And 17.6 contains three significant figures as well. So we need to report our final answer in three significant figures. So looking at our answer 13.36, obviously there is 6 here, which is the fourth digit. Next to our third digit is greater than 5. So we need to add one more. So the final answer is equal to 13.4 miles per gallon. All right. And remember, don't forget your units. So it means that 17.6 liters of fuel being used for every 100 kilometers is equal to 13.4 miles per gallon fuel efficiency. All right. So that is all for this example. Thank you for listening and continue learning.